Obamacare is based on the mistaken premise that countries with greater government control over health care do a better job of disciplining health spending and get better outcomes. Neither of those is true. The conventional wisdom is that the U.S. spends 60% too much. When those data are correctly analyzed, we actually spend only 1.5% too much. In contrast, countries such as France spend 19% too much, and in single-payer countries such as the U.K. and Canada spend more than 20% too little. That suggests a degree of rationing that I don't think most Americans would find acceptable. Healthcare outcomes in the United States actually are among the best in the world when you only focus on the thing where medical care matters. For example, if you take away violent deaths, U.S. life expectancy is number one in the OECD. My book was not designed to give a prescription for how to reform American health care. It was designed to get the facts straight because until we get the facts straight, we can't have discussion about how to reform healthcare in this country.